Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. This week I wanted to talk about the five most important things that you need to know when you're planning your script. So when you're planning a script, it can be really helpful to just have different information to move you along in that planning process. Different scripts are going to require different things. For example, something that's a little bit more sci-fi based or futuristic, you're gonna need to do a lot of world building in your planning process. But something that's based today isn't gonna necessarily need as much because you have the world around you as a setup. But these are the things that I think as a base are really important to know and have ready when you start writing your script and outlining and all of that. So the first thing is character names and their bios and backgrounds. The names aren't as important, but as you get closer to the actual writing of the script, you're gonna wanna know names, even if they're just placeholders for now, but be warned, my placeholders have often turned into the long-term names. So if you can figure something out, that's always great to have in that planning process. And knowing who your characters are, where they come from, what their motivations are, makes such a difference when you're planning out a story and plotting where things are gonna go because character drives so much of where a story goes. The next thing that you're gonna wanna figure out is your story arcs and your story lines. Different scripts are gonna have different needs and you can you know, figure this out based on the story you're trying to tell. But you need to know what your A story is, your B story is, even potentially your C story, and figure out how those drive your script because that will help you so much more when you turn to the actual like beat board and figuring out what exactly is gonna happen. If you have an idea of what your stories are and where they're kind of leading throughout your script, it will make that part of the process so much easier and it will make everything flow so much better. The next thing you're gonna to wanna to figure out is your log line. If you're not familiar with log lines, it's a one to two sentence kind of summary of your project. Um, a lot of people will also call this your elevator pitch. It needs to be really short, but kind of get the whole idea across. If you're interested in learning more about how to construct a log line or what needs to go into it, let me know, I can definitely film a video on that but it's really important to have that all together. And I've actually even plotted stories and scripts based on a log line I came up with and then flushed it out further. So your log line is super important to this process. And you also wanna know what's your setting for your story. So I talked about this a little bit earlier. A sci-fi story is going to have a lot of different needs, especially in the planning process, than a modern day story that takes place in our world. Um, so you want to know your setting, so where is something taking place, not just is it on Earth, but is it in Florida or is it in Miami? You know, those make big differences in how you construct a story, but also the time period. So look at Bridgerton, that's a very different time even though it's on Earth in England, I assume. Um, that's going to make a big difference. So the time period and where your story is taking place and anything else that really impacts those two things are really important to have set in your planning. And the last thing that I want to talk about here is your audience. Who are you writing this script for? Who's going to enjoy this script? And it doesn't have to be ultra specific, though if you can be specific, great. But just generally even, is this a children's show? Is this something that's going to appeal to, you know, teenagers and middle school, like around that age? Or is this a show that's for adults? Or is this a show that's only for adults. All of those things really play such a role in how you go about then writing your show and or your film and how you potentially want to market it or where you want to share it because you're not going to share your adults only script with Disney Plus, right? Like that's not going to be a good fit. I mean, it, you won't necessarily be sharing it with Disney Plus, but in the grand scheme of things, Knowing who your audience is makes such a big difference once you A, are starting the writing process and B, after you've written it, when you want to show it to people, 
knowing the right people to show it to. I think those are really the five things that stick out to me as across the board important things to know. Again, there's a lot more to plan when you're writing a script, but sometimes that stuff gets more specific into the script you're writing and what you need to know and how your thought process works as far as a planning goes. And then after I've figured out that basic planning, that's when I like to move into my beat board where I have beat by beat exactly what's going to happen in my script. If you want more videos about anything like this, please let me know in the comments section. And if you're new to my channel, make sure that you hit the subscribe button and click the bell so you don't miss any notifications from my channel. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys next week. Bye.